Well, it's something that you don't see very often. The Denver Pioneer hockey team put up 70 shots and tied a hockey game. 70 shots, only 17 for Lake Superior State. And Denver with a official 3-3 tie. They do send the fans home happy with the double overtime winning goal by Jared Luco Savages. Joining me, head coach Jim Montgomery. And, and coach, uh, obviously the, the biggest challenge that you guys had tonight with Lake State was their forecheck. They were able to create a couple of turnovers that immediately led to goals. Yeah, they did a good job. We didn't do a good job of moving pucks quickly, and uh, our communication was poor. And then our crisis defense, when we caused turnovers, player, no one was inside the, the dots protecting our net front. So that really hurt us, and um, it's a good lesson for us to learn. You know, and then when you coach a game in which your team has so many opportunities, you hit three posts. I mean, it's just it seemed like you're doing everything right offensively but not scoring. What, what do you say to your team on the bench? Well, I like the way we responded, right? We kept coming back at them. I mean, a lot of teams would have just hung their head after coming back and tying it up 2-2, and they go ahead 3-2, and we just kept coming back at them. And I thought we were going to win in overtime, and obviously the, the biggest disappointment for me isn't uh, the lack of scoring. It's it's our special teams. It's three games in a row where we get outplayed on special teams. Yeah, you go 0 for, 0 for 4 tonight on the power play, although much like other parts of the game, it seemed like you, you set up grade-A scoring chances time and time again and just couldn't finish. Yeah, well, we're not handling pucks clean. We're not moving pucks quickly enough. Uh, two guys move the puck quickly, next guy handles it, uh, way over handles it, and they get in, uh, sticks and bodies in uh, puck lanes or shot lanes, so depending on the play. But we're just not crisp, and uh, you know what? That's really upon our top players because they always get the first opportunity, and they're out there for at least a minute and sometimes a lot more than that. You know, and uh, another guy that is suddenly looking like a real offensive threat for you, uh, you know, he's, he had a great second half of last season, but Liam Finley, I mean, every time he has the puck, I mean, the speed, the quickness, and then his ability to, to find spaces and more importantly to finish, you know, two straight uh, big go uh, games for him. Yeah, he's been really good. I mean, he's been one of our best players from day one uh, this year in practice, and he's carried that over to games. And uh, he's having a really good year, and I expect him to do really good things for us. You know, tough game for Tanner uh, Gillette in the sense that he, he faces such few shots, a couple of uh, two-on-ones right in front of him. And as a goaltender, I mean, there's no. I think I only said his name a few times all night long. Got to be tough to get into the flow. Yeah, you know, uh, if we come out and play the same way, hopefully we can finish a little more and uh, hopefully uh, we don't give up as many shots. You know, T Tanner Tanner was fine. Tanner wasn't as sharp as he usually was uh, or is. Well, this Pioneer team came back strong in the second and third periods, and uh, do you expect uh, any wholesale changes for tomorrow night? Uh, lineup, you mean? I review film and make that change, uh, make the decisions in the morning. You know, there's a lot of players that deserve to play, and uh, there's some players that I'm not sure had, you know, uh, did all that much to play Denver hockey tonight. All right, well, long night for you. You had all the national championship banner raising. You've got parents weekend. You didn't even call me today. I mean, so obviously you're a very busy man, and you're going to sleep well tonight. Yeah, I'm uh, looking forward to getting home and watching film and uh, getting back at it because, you know, there's so many more positives than negatives from tonight. You generate that many shots and you have that much possession. Uh, we got to take away eyes better, but uh, we'll watch film and we just need to keep getting better. All right. Thanks, Coach. Thanks.